Hi guys, let's continue our discussion on ratios. But today, let's discuss turnover ratios. A very interesting concept in financial management. Now forget for a moment that we are talking about financial management. Let's understand what does the word turnover mean in English. Turnover, move, movement, change, circulation, something that is moving, that is my turnover. Now we want to talk about turnover ratios. So we are basically interested in knowing some kind of movement. Now what movement are we interested in? Whose movement are we interested in? Let us get into that. Now the first ratio that I want to discuss with you is working capital turnover. Now before we get into working capital turnover, I like to build every concept using the ingredients of that concept. When I say working capital turnover, it's important for me to know what is working capital. Working capital basically means the funds deployed required for my day-to-day -day business activities. If I'm investing in a machinery, that is not my day-to-day expenditure day-to-day -day outflow but if i am buying raw material if i am paying my workers all of that is my day-to-day -day activity so the funds required for my day-to-day -day activity is my that denotes my working capital now if again because you know all of us love formulas so much let's understand how do you calculate working capital working capital or net working capital is current assets minus current liability this was the this was one of the ingredients in our discussion of working capital turnover now let me start with the formula how do i calculate working capital turnover it's total sales divided by net working capital total sales divided by net working capital now what am i trying to achieve by doing this See guys, just because you know you have numbers in a balance sheet, you could calculate the ratio of anything to anything. You could possibly calculate, you know, furniture upon debt, something like this. Doesn't mean that just because you have two numbers, putting them together in a numerator denominator format is sensible. But I have told you right now, working capital turnover is total sales divided by net working capital. Now, this ratio basically tells me how efficiently have I used my working capital to generate sales? How has my working capital moved in a year to generate a certain kind of sale? Let's start simple. Say I'm talking about two companies and one company has a total turnover of 20 lakh. The other company has a total turnover of 30 lakh. When I say turnover, I mean sales total sales. Now one company total sales is 20, second company total sales is 30. The net working capital that is current assets minus current liabilities for both the companies is 2 lakh. Let's get that information once again. One company 20 lakh sale, second company 30 lakh sale. Net working capital is the same for both. Now if I were to ask you what is the working capital turnover for the first company? You would say, sir, it's 20 lakh upon 2 lakh, 10. For the second company, you would say it's 30 lakh upon 2 lakh, which is 15. Now, see what I'm trying to drive here. In the second company, I had net working capital of 2 lakh. And churning that around the year, moving that around the year, I was able to generate 30 lakh worth of sale. 2 lakh working capital. I generated a sale of 30 lakh. This company, 2 lakh working capital, I generated a sale of 20 lakh. Now tell me, where have I used my resources more efficiently? Clearly the answer is going to be this company where I had with a 2 lakh working capital, I could generate 30 lakh worth of sale. So won't you say that the finance manager in the second company, the production manager in the second company, the treasury department in the second company is doing a better job because with the same resource, they are able to generate a higher sale. If to make matters simple, I take two hours and I do four chapters. You take two hours and you do eight chapters. 
who's doing the job better when it comes to studying you because in the same time you are giving a higher output i am churning those two hours to give four hours of studies or four chapters of studies you are churning those two hours and giving me eight chapters worth of output second company with a 2 lakh worth of networking capital is giving me 30 lakh worth of sale first company with 2 lakhs of working capital is giving me only 20 lakh worth of sale so i have used my available resources i have moved them i have churned them in a better way to generate 15 times the output with a 2 lakh working capital i have been able to achieve more in the second company so clearly if you want to evaluate how efficiently have you used your networking capital your day to day funds to conduct your business my answer would always tilt in favor of the second company because with less or with the same quantity of working capital same value or of working capital the second company was able to generate more sales if as an investor imagine this data is presented in front of you and nothing else it would help you decide where do you want to put your money it would help you understand where exactly should your money go where exactly is the growth opportunity this company is doing a better job why not invest your money in that company which is doing a better job so again as i said our ratios are numbers but they are not the answer to anything they are indicators ki okay this is the direction you need to focus in this is what you need to observe and then make an informed decision we discussed the liquidity ratios in the previous video right now we have discussed one turnover ratio amongst the many there is a net asset turnover there is a receivable turnover there is an inventory turnover there is a payable turnover we have many many ratios in the turnover ratio family my point in this and the other videos is going to be numbers you have formula also you have but what do these numbers mean when they are presented in front of you are they nudging you in the right direction if you want to know more of this please subscribe to our channel like the video and share it thank you